Second Sunday of December. We thank God for what the Lord has been using each of us to achieve, each of us to get into what God asks us to be. We thank God so much for you all, especially we, the children of God, that are still, we are the remnant still remaining. Others have come and others have gone to the grave. People you know today, tomorrow you will not see them again. Everything is happening right in your very eyes. The people are just going one after the other. Especially where we are now in the South Korea. So we thank God for we that are alive. Thank God so much. Uh, 2023, let me let you know that uh, God is preparing people for 2023. Amen. Uh, is, um, I just, I, I can't, uh, for 2023, you know, the fire, that's what we say, keep the fire burning. The fire 
23. You see the prayers we the that's you know the section here it was fire to fire. The one that the last person who prayed concerning compromising. Let's say compromising is too much in the church. Compromising. You are here, you are here. Which one are you? Um, you, you are not you are not anywhere. You, uh, this will say, okay, let's go and smoke. Okay. Don't smoke. Okay. But where are you? That's compromising, especially in, in the church, in the body of Christ. It's so rampant now. It's so rampant. Compromising in the church. Yes. So I thank you for that prayer that was being led, that spirit of compromising to the lost, especially in the body of Christ. Then pray for marriage also, the nation also. And pray for the sick. All these things are important. They are in the body of Christ. In the body of Christ. People get sick. So marriages are crumbling. I'm telling you, nations are going down. I'm telling you, my brother. Converting in the church of God. That's why there's no power in the church. So we give God the glory so much for you all. Before we um, go into the world, um, Shalom will come out and tell us is because normally we have what we call Bible recitation. And the Bible says, Turn up a child in the way he should go, and when it's all, what happened? This is the best inheritance for them. Amen. Morning we finish, but the best one is this one the blessing. It's in the book. I'm telling you. So, shall I tell them what you have? What is what? Tell them the uh, Bible recitation. You speak loud, okay? Amen. 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 Genesis chapter 1, verse 3. Mm -hmm. God said, let them be joy. There was life. Amen. 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 It's a Genesis 1, 3. It's in, uh, what happened? God said, let there be light. And there was what? Light. Oh, thank you so much. Now we call upon Daniel. Daniel, yeah, I don't know if you're going to say one or two. So Daniel, come. Let's see what Daniel has for us today. If you can pass the other side. Yes. So this is how to train up the child. So if you are here, it just don't say here is for training. <laughs> Amen. 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 Proverbs 3 verse 5. Trust in the Lord with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. Amen. 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 Philippians 4 verse 13. I can do all things through Christ that strengthens me. Amen. Somebody shout hallelujah. Amen. 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 Things for with age. Join it to God and He will join it to you. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. These are the children of God. Amen. Be trained. Be trained. I'm telling you. So, what they have given today is no devil can take it out from them. Amen. Yeah, I didn't teach them, but the Holy Spirit did. As they open the scripture, that's the Holy Spirit. You pop on them. I didn't tell them this is what you're going to say. They just go to the scriptures and begin to. And those who don't have them. Amen? Amen. 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 Hallelujah. 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 Amen. I want to thank you all for coming. Wonderful people of God. And uh, our brother Joseph uh, from Sowon. Most of you may not know him. He's from Sowon. And uh, he's also a student. And he'll be on the lab. And uh, you know, he's been with us from Seoul and also from Anza. Also, I mean, Seoul and also right here in Anza. You know, he said he wants to work for God. You know, you see, for someone to come and say he wants to work for God, what do you do? You allow him to do what God asks him to do. You don't sit down with him. He's from so on. He's not from Anza. He's so on, so on. So on. He's coming from so on. I'm telling you, you know the boss is going to take. So, if he's closer to God, God will be closer to him. Amen. So, we're not going to stop him. Yeah. You know, God is going to be using him more. Amen. 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 That is it. That is it. God is going to be using him, using him, using him to break the kingdom of darkness. Amen. 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 And also, my brother here, 
I call thee my spiritual son, Gilbert. You know, you forgot, I hope you remember the marriage was conducted. Yes. They are my spiritual sons. And he's here today. Amen. 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 Why I say my spiritual son? Because he's coming back to the Lord. Amen. Before he went back too far. <laughs> now it's back, it's back, it's back, it's back, it's back. Amen. It's back. And the Lord will do with him what he wants to do. Amen. Yes, he's here, he's ready. Whatever be fit for him to do, he will do it. Amen. 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 And I want to thank you all, Leticia, Esther. You see what you know, the friend and the worship. God, take the glory, amen. It's wonderful, so so powerful. I'm telling you, uh, thank you so much. Our Dickin, Dickiness, Dickin, Eric Dickiness, the Clarice, thank you also for your time. Say, Sister Joella, you know, Joella, not Joella, you know, you know, he was being down for some time, he went for the surgery on our throat and everything was done and today she can talk speak praise god somebody shout hallelujah hallelujah and also we talk about for sister sister lisa the lisa these days have been going backward but i called her yesterday i believe you saw the phone call you saw my missed call go back to your phone and check <laughs> yeah, so she's been going back. I don't know why. I don't know why. You know, I can't fire tell you. On. I'm like the fire father. On, my no, no, correct. I'm like the father. So, father will speak for you. Hmm? So, do you want me to hide and speak to you? No. So, don't try that again, Lisa. Don't try it again. I don't know who's pushing you back. Is it Quentin or you? I don't know. <laughs> Because marriage is supposed to be from glory to glory, fire to fire. I'm telling you, so please try as we think about 2023, okay? Yeah. Okay, Lisa? Nice yes, but that is it. I'm just telling you, I'm not angry with you, okay? That's the truth. Try. Try your best and fair possible for 2023. Don't, don't try to go back. Amen? Amen. Okay, thank God for our brother here, Titus. Now, look at Titus. Put your hands together for Titus. Because if you know what happened to him some months ago mm. with his bicycle, that would have landed him somewhere. And that is supposed to be his own birthday. Yeah. Is that not correct? His own birthday. Okay. I'm telling you, his own birthday, his own birthday, this thing happened. Ah! The time God, everything was made of what? Avante. Yeah. And I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Yes. It's the only money they took. Thank God, not his life. Oh, his life can take more money. You know what I'm Life, life is number one now. Uh -huh. I'm telling you. So I give God the glory for his life today. And I thank God so much that he has made up his mind to be part of this ministry finally. Amen. 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 So, so he never told me that I'm, I'm speaking for him. <laughs> uh, he never told me, but I'm speaking for him. I'm telling you. Because you know, Madam, Madam, Madam is here. He's also here. Yes. Madam is here. He's here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah. Hallelujah. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah, yeah. And thank God also for Brahim. You know, I called him this afternoon when we were coming. He already told me, he's already here and he's coming. I mean, the brother Ima, the one on the, uh, you know, yes, the one, the one on the drum. You know, because I wanted to, you know, I wanted to call him and let him know, remind him. Before you know, he said, he, you know, without me talking. That is it. So, I thank you so much, sir. Yes, if I want you to do it, there's a reward. I'm telling you, he does so it. You know, shall what? Shall also read. Read in joy. The Bible says, it has soaked in tears. Shall what? Shall read in joy. You know what it called tears? Tears is not middle tears. 
your commitment, those are tears. You think it's easy to walk into the snow, I mean into the winter? It's not easy, it's very cold, it's very cold, you cannot come in. I was so surprised that the day we were having Thanksgiving in Seoul, Joanna took the baby and entered the train, start coming. She never told me. I was surprised to see her with the baby. Eh? I'm telling you. And she listened, you know, she listened, answer. She cried, they entered the train and start coming to, to, to you know, to Seoul. That is commitment, is that not correct? It is. It has sowed in tears, shall read in John, Psalm 126. Oh, wow. You know, tears, tears. Prayer is tears, don't you know? Prayer, faith, commitment, those are tears. But when you start repeating it, eh? <laughs> you will repeat in joy. Amen. Now before I go on, there is, there is a testimony I want to give you right now, before I go on. This is not for me, but for, for one sister. This sister was going through some kind of trauma. You know, in answer, when any lady comes in answer, you'll see the boys rush that lady. This lady has been going through such thing until she came out. She said she's no more anymore. She called mama and tell her everything. Mama not told me. And asked the caller, was he talking? And this person is already a married man somewhere. Oh, yeah. oh. And they belong to the same church. Oh. Oh. I, told, I told the lady, I said, you know what? Tell the person, Pastor Benjamin is your, is your father. Oh. Tell the person, says, your father, is, your special father is Pastor Benjamin. <laughs> and he told him, and from that day, the boy left him. He left her. He left her. He left her right now. I'm telling you, this sister now is not enjoying a new life in Christ. Amen. I'm telling you, my brother, things are happening. Of the name Pastor Benjamin. Everything shall pass. Let's show Pastor Benjamin. The sister now is an, eh? she's enjoying a new life. Oh, I'm telling you. Because immediately she come in to answer, you know, there's some some boys. Yeah, so many. Eh? Radical boys. <laughs> 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 I'm telling you, oh, you know. Yeah, yeah, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. And she just came to Mars, you know. And she told me, Pastor, she she has water baptism for two months. That means she's still a new Christian. So she needs a refreshing of fire. We need to open her eyes on what we're going to discuss last week and today now. I'm telling my brother. So you cannot be in this ministry and begin to do her work. Okay. Don't even come here at all. Because I'm telling you, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't be going Maradona here. <laughs> I'm telling you, you cannot just come here and begin to hear nonsense from outside. You have no, 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 no. No, no, you don't try that here. This is a ministry. Is, it's a ministry from God. What others cannot say, we're going to say it here. I'm telling you, so please keep clean. Just keep clean. Amen? Amen. Amen. So the sister now, she has a new life in Christ. Amen. The old things are passed away. Yes. Two days ago, I called her. She called me. I said, I hope, I hope, before I could say, he said, Pastor, I should forget about the past. Ah, thank you, Jesus. If somebody tell you that, that, that person has called the fire. Thank you, Jesus. All things have called. Don't, don't take me back to the past. Mm. So I just stand up for the sister. Don't worry, you will see the sister one day. You will see her one day. You will see that sister one day. You know, I'm telling you. And God has given her a, a wonderful job, a good job, and a good location, a good house. So we are telling on Keep the Fire Burning, part two. We, we started, you know, our series this, this month is on um, fire for us to enter 2023. Now let's see the scripture. Let's see the, uh, the first scripture today. It says, in speaking of the angels, he says, he makes his angel what? Spirit. Spirit. And what? 
Now, who is that supposed to be on fire? But why are you not on fire? Anytime you take the mic to sing, you are ministering. Don't you know? Anytime you play the piano or play the drum, you are a minister, ministering. So, you're supposed to be flesh of fire. Now, flesh of fire means unquenchable. Something that cannot be quenched. I'm telling you, that's why ministers that were ordained here need to be on fire. As we step into 2023, have you seen Pastor Benjamin in a day falling down? No way. I cannot. No, 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 I cannot. I cannot. No way. I've come too long. Way to go back. Mm. I've been sold out. So, ministers of fire, that is who we are. Father, we thank you. Breathe in your word, your power, your spirit, into this, your word today. Let your word touch every, every heart today. Yes. And make us that fire, unquenchable one. Thank you, Jesus. Speak through me, Lord. Holy Spirit, you are in charge. Take the stage now and do what only you can do and give you back the glory. It's in Jesus Christ that we pray. Amen. Amen. Now, Keep the fire on. That means to say that the angels, they are spirits. Because nobody has seen an angel before. So before we fall, you know, we should see angel. Whenever you see an angel right now, it's coming to give you a message. Or for, to deliver to you, you know, a message from God. Amen. But this is, we are not seeing angels now. I'm telling you. But he said he makes his angels spirit and his servants. Who are the servants? The ministers. So anytime you take the mic, eh, the mic to sing or to pray or whatever, you are you are a minister, ministering. You are ministering. Either, either through strong, either through songs, or through interceding, or through whatever. You become a minister that that area. Amen. Because you are ministering. Then why are you ministering? Because you become that fire. That flames on fire. But today I understood that many Christians are only used to water baptism. You know, last time we talk about water baptism, Holy Spirit baptism, and what? Fire, fire baptism. baptism. Now we are going to sing a song that relates to that. This song is what? Fire, fire, fire. Uh -huh. No, no, this one is different. This one is another one again. No, that one is also different. That, that one is my own part. <laughs> but this one is another, 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 another one. Oh, I, 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 so, uh, so my mom will come and sing it there because it's a very popular song. Yes, uh, we're going to Jamaica. Yes, Hallelujah. yes. By Tony, by Tony, 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 Tony McLaughlin. Okay. I've got my mind made up. Let's stand on our feet. Yeah, I've got my mind made up. So we Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. I've got my mind made up. Praise God. Hallelujah. I've got my mind made up. And I won't come back. Because I'm gonna see my Jesus. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna see my Jesus.
from all of you. Amen. Thank you, Thank you so much for that, man. This is this is this is after all, you know. I'm telling you. Yes, because his name is so sweet. Emmanuel's name is Ooh. so sweet. Fire. Good night, world. We don't know what's staying. With you. Mm. With my pleasure of sin. Pleasure of sin. So sin is a pleasure. Mm. Mm -hmm. But no it longer. kills at the end. No I say, I say, sin is a pleasure. Mm. But it kills. My God, my God. Anytime you meet a woman that is not your mm. wife, you are exchanging something. Yeah. <laughs> you don't you know mm. that white blood? You are exchanging, taking your destiny. It's not your wife, it's not your husband, but you are sleeping with your person. There is an instinct there. Except it's your husband or your wife. I'm telling you, my brother, it's true. There's an instinct there. So if you like, continue. If you like, continue to carry women that is not your wife. Or men that is not your husband. But the end shall tell. There is no smoke without fire. Eh? I'll tell you, I'll tell you, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. So we are dealing on the subject, keep the fire burning. So, you can see that many Christians are only used to water baptism. But not the baptism of fire. So they are aware of the Holy Spirit, but not aware of fire baptism. What about this? It begins about, it brings about repentance at only. So we are going to see the other scriptures now in Luke. Let's read it down. John answered them all, I baptize you with water. That is John now, John, John. You see, this is John now, this is John now, John, John. John said, I baptize you with water. But one who is more powerful than I will come. That means future, we miss future, we come, we come. Will come. You know, will come. The strength of the sandals I am not worthy to untie. That means his shoe. I cannot I cannot wear his shoes. I'm telling you. He will baptize you with Holy Spirit and what? You see now, so you can see both of them, Holy Spirit and fire. Then his will knowing fork is in his hand. This means the fan. If it's a lie, you can ask the farmer. They have that fork. Is that not correct? Yes. Ask the farmer, they have that fork. I'm telling you. So it says, and to clear the traffic floor, you see the fog, the clearing, the, the, the funny, clearing it. As the farmer, they will tell you what the scripture means. And to gather the wheat into his barn. A barn is where you put, you put what? You put your yam, is that correct? Uh -huh. You put your yam for the next harvest, I mean, for the next what? Eh? Uh? Exactly, that is it. So the, the barn, but it will burn it. You see now, it will burn up the shaft from that pan with unquenchable that is it you put it there but they will still go there and burn those things that are not supposed to be with it so my brother my sisters in Christ the baptism is for you to walk in the power of God and the baptism and to manifest God's presence now when the baptism of fire comes upon you do we know it that is the word do we know it means the fan the fan increases the fire. The more of the fan, the more the fire. The more of the fan, the more of the fire. The more of the fan, the more of the fire. When you are filled with the Holy Ghost and be baptized by fire, you will be preserved. You will what? be preserved. Every unwanted thing in your body will be burnt with fire. If there is sickness, it will burn it out by fire. If there's anything deadly, it will get burnt. So if there's sin, it catches fire. Because it is unquenchable fire. Anytime you are on fire, no dull moment. Not today is good, tomorrow is bad. No, no dull moment. You turn on the future to be a program. A program, program. No problem in your life. All is program, 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 program. If there's anger, it burns it out. You'll be looking for the anger, but you can't get the anger. Because when you burn it off, you'll be looking for it again. Things that will get you angry. Instead, you're laughing. I'm telling you. Instead, you turn it into a joke. <laughs> I'm telling you. 
something that will make you get angry. Why? Because fire has dealt with it. Fire is used for many things. Fire can burn. Burn. Fire has no direction. Fire has no direction. Fire has no direction. Fire can go anywhere and everywhere. Fire has no respect. Whether it's a president or a boss, it can burn him or her. Mm -hmm. My brother, fire has no mercy. Fire consumes. Fire penetrates. Why fire? Because our God, let's go to the next one. Why fire? Why fire? For the Lord your God is what? It and it's jealous God. See, so God is jealous for you. Anytime you commit those fire, he's jealous for you. That's why you see him wiping you. Wiping you because he's jealous. Doesn't want you to commit those things that fire has already born. Because he's the consuming fire. He's the consuming fire. He's the one that born. God is the consuming fire. And a jealous eh? God. That is why fire is necessary. God called himself the consuming fire. God says we shall be baptized by unquenchable fire. Fire baptism is very important to Christians and to believers. Why is it important? Let's see Isaiah. Why is it important? I want to see it. Isaiah. Let's see Isaiah. At the sound of their voices, the dog posts and the church floor shook and the temple was filled with smoke. In this one. What to me? I cried. I am renewed, for I am a man of unclean lips. You see? And I live among a people of unclean lips. You see? It's a man with unclean lips. I live among people with unclean lips. Nowhere to grow because of the people around you. Hey, man, nowhere to grow. You want to grow, but they will choke you. I'm telling you. Is it? And my eyes have seen the King, the, the Lord the Almighty. The one of the seraphim, that is the angels now. And then you see the seraphim is the angel. Seraphim, the cherubim, the seraphim. You know? Feel to me with a live coal in his hand, which he had taken with tongues from the altar. With it, he touched my mouth and said, See, this has touched your lips. Your guilt is taken away, and your sin atoned for. Number seven. Eight. Then I heard the voice of the Lord saying, Who shall I send? <laughs> and who will go for us? And I said, Here am I sent. Until you have fire, you can't move. Hey. Huh. Isaiah was, was feeling guilty because of the people around him. Isaiah 1, he did not know anything. 2, 3, 4, everybody has a chapter in his life. Amen. But when he got to 6, something happened. Because Isaiah 6 verse 1 says, Isaiah 6 verse 1, one no. It says, until the day of King Uzziah died, I saw oh, the Lord. And now I want to look at what he's saying to us now. The last, he said, then I heard the voice of the Lord saying, who shall I send? And who will go for us? And I said, here I am, send me. The Lord himself, not the pastor now. <laughs> The pastor can talk to you, but the day you encounter God, the difference between altar call and encounter. Altar call is for daily, but encounter is for life. I repeat again. Altar call is for that day. Give your life to Christ. But people will go and take the life out from Christ again. So an encounter is for life. Because the Lord, and I heard the voice, not the, not the voice of the pastor. The voice of who? Not the voice of the pastor. But the voice of the Lord said, Who shall I send? And who will go for us? And I said, Here I am, here am I. Send me. Send me now. Fire has caught him. Fire has taken away the sin and the pity. Fire has put him away. Fire has taken away those sins, those reproaches out for him. On the fire settles on you, you cannot go for God. If fire touches you, you will see, you want to do this for God. People will say, ah, ah, now you carry church for her. Now you carry church for her every time, every time. Her. Why? Because of the fire. fire. Not water about this, you know. Have you seen the say, keep water about this on? No, keep the fire on. Yeah. Water about this is good, it's for repentance. So, my brother, Isaiah, Isaiah said, Here I am, Lord, send me. Because fire caught in him. 
Fire removed the gates. Fire removed the sins. Those things that the enemy, enemy is looking at. Fire touched them out. And he said, Lord, here am I, send me. Who is prepared to go for the Lord? 2023. Can I see your hand? That is it. That is, that is it. So prepare yes, for 2023. Use me, Lord. Because, because we are preparing you to enter 2023. As a matter of fact, you are already, you are, you are already here. I'm telling you, my brother. So my brother, and my, so my brother and my sisters in Christ. Do we have smoke without fire? No. No matter, no matter, there must be smoke. One of the angels brought the fire, no? don't forget, and touched the leaves of Elijah. The leaves. Sometimes when we go out for Belen, you know, Belen, we are afraid to speak. We are afraid to speak. You know why? You know why? Because because of your clean leaves around him too. Please go back. Let's see. Please go back. Please. Let's, 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 please go back. Uh -huh. You say, uh huh. Well, uh, there's a place here. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. At the sound of their voices, the dog post threshold shook and the temple was filled with smoke. Go ahead now. Then what to me? I cried. I am good for. I am a man. You see? I'm a man. He agreed that he, he agreed that he's a man of our own Why? I live among people. You see now? Of unclean lips. Most of us we live among people that will not allow you to grow. Today you are cold, tomorrow you are hot. Why? Because of the surrounding you are. Today you are warm, tomorrow you are hot. Why? Because of the environment, the people that you make up with. I'm telling you, look at I'm not saying that, I'm just letting you know. He said, because I live among people of unclean lips. And my eyes, he said, and now my eyes have seen the king. <laughs> you see now? He said, and now my eyes have seen the king, the Lord Almighty. The one of the seraphim appealed to me, that is the agent, appealed to me with a life code. You know, life code in his hand. Please don't forget what happened to John. John too saw the angel and said, give me the book. Now in his hand, which he had taken with tongues from the altar, from the altar, with, with it, he touched my mouth and said, see, this has touched your lips. Your gift is taken away. Amen. Your sin atoned for. Hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. There's no more sin anymore. Mm. Don't feel guilty of your past. Don't feel guilty of your past. Your past is forgotten. Your past is gone. Don't feel guilty. Don't go back to what you have left. Don't feel guilty. Your past is gone. Your sin is forgiven. Because it has been atoned for with the blood of Jesus Christ. Then the next one now, look at what he's saying. Let's go. Uh -huh. The next one now. Uh -huh. He said, Then I heard the voice of the Lord saying, Who shall I send? You see now? After the sins, the getting out, the taking away. <laughs> now the voice, you know, begin to hear clearly before he cannot hear. What he's hearing was King Uzziah's voice. Do not forget that he died. In the death since verse 1, he already died. Now he cannot hear. Most of us, we have not heard the voice of the Lord. Because we are compacted with so much load. Burden of this, of that, of that. So we cannot hear when God is speaking. Because of those things, those junk, until, he, until that junk is caught in a way, then you can be hearing the voice of God. And he said, yes, I heard the voice of the Lord saying, who shall I send? And who will go for us? And I said, Ye am I. Send me. See, who we go for us? Who are the us? We. He's not talking for only himself. He's talking for we too. Is that not correct? That's why I'm asking you who is going for the Lord. Everybody raise yourself up. So prepare for 2023. Whatever you ask, say, send me, O oh Lord. Send, send me, O oh Lord. Lord. I'm not the one sending you. I'm not, I'm please. I'm not the one sending you. Please, oh, is the Lord sending you? Amen. 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 So, my brother, my sisters, in Christ, after he thought his lips, his sins disappeared by fire. Whatever you are, say with me, I need fire baptism. I need fire say it, say, I need fire baptism. I need fire baptism. In my life, in, my life. in the name of Jesus Christ. My brother, my sister, when you catch fire, it removes every unwanted thing in your life. Whether it's causing or depression or any deadly diseases, Fire can purify. Fire purges from the inside out. Fire purges from the inside out. 
What about this is just only for the outside, and they will give you a certificate. And, and you go and put it in your living room. And maybe you want to enlarge it. But when fire comes, it has a certificate. It is for life. Somebody shout hallelujah. I'm telling you. You know, I was baptized because my wife, you know, we were just looking at the certificate I have. I was baptized in 1993. <laughs> 1993. And I was ordained as a pastor in 2007. I'm telling you, those are records. But is that in the spirit? And it's not the spirit, so fire has a record. I'm telling you. What fire comes from the past? Who is the president or who is a uh, who is the president or who is the boss? So my brother, my sisters in Christ, how can you be baptized into fire? Let's see the last scripture. How can we uh, let's see ahead? Uh, he said, it is that remember that it is tricky. Zeal for your for your house. We what? Now which house? Not your old physical house. Mm. Like here now, the house of the Lord. Amen. It consume you. When it is time for Bible study, you want to be there. You want to, you want to make sure that is zeal. zeal. When it's time for Friday prayer, you want to be there. That is zeal. Mm. When it's a Sunday, you want to put on your clothes for you know for yesterday. You don't want to be late. That is what the zeal. The zeal means the fire. Because the disciple remembered what he said. The Bible says, disciple remember that it is written, the zeal of the of your heart will what to consume me. My brother, my sister, the, the, the disciples remember there's fire burning in them. So we have been eaten by the fire. That, that is the meaning. Meaning, I have been eaten by the fire. Meaning that there are forces of hell against you, resisting you from going to church, resisting your dedication, resisting your commitments, resisting you from praying, fasting, because there's fire in you. You will always find yourself in the church of God. When that fire comes upon you, right. the ones who resist you from prayer, resist you from believing, resist you from fasting, resisting you, the one is still of God consume you. You want to do, you want to pray. You want, you want to say pray. Yes. What is consuming you now? The fire. Fire. You want to pray. As you get home today, mm. uh, before you sleep, say, No, I'm not going to sleep like this. I'm going to pray. What makes you pray is the fire. fire. I want to pray. Because prayer is not about the quality, it's about the quality. Is, eh? I repeat again. Prayer is not about the what? The quantity is about the quality. I'm telling you, because you are serious with God, God will not tell you 20 hours to pray. It's just your prayer with Him. It's your Him. It's your Him. But the result will come out later. Result of what you do in the secret. Because Psalm 91 verse 1 says, Either dwell yet in the secret place of the most high shall abide under, under the, shadow the shadow of the Almighty. Almighty. So, you are under the shadow because you are dwelling in the secret. The secret is your prayer life. Hallelujah. Your prayer life. Your prayer life. So, your prayer life is your showroom in the public. Hey. Mm. I'm telling you, my brother, and my sisters in Christ. Yes. So, the disciples remember there's fire upon it. They remember. That's why you see them pray. You see them fast. That's why I see them going for evangelism. Evangelism. You know, last two months or last week, we talked about so winning. So winning, 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 so winning. Most of you cannot talk to so you know why? Because you too, we join them to commit sin. How can you speak to somebody who you slept with last night? How can you talk to somebody who you smoked cigarette last night? Is it possible, Dicky? Yes? It's not possible now. Somebody you finished drinking alcohol with. You say, well, let's go to church. Say, you, 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 you are, you, you, you. Oh That's why it's heavy for you to tell somebody, let's go and worship God. Because you're also committing what is also what? Eh? What is also what? Answer now, people, look at the church just quiet. <laughs> oh, the church just quiet now. Nah. <laughs> the church just quiet now. Nah. Because evangelism starts from you. It's not from you. I'm telling you. Your lifestyle, your character. Before somebody will ask you, which church do you go to? I want to go and see your God in that church. So, my brother, 
my sisters, if you don't have fire, look, you cannot pray, you cannot fast, you cannot have faith. I'm telling you. So, my brother, we need fire for this end time race. Amen? Amen. Fire cleanses us from sin. It burns the inner, inner, inner. Now, let's see the other scriptures again. Now, therefore, I urge you, brothers and sisters, in view of God's mercy, to offer your bodies as what? A living sacrifice. Holy and pleasing to God. This is your true and proper worship. Do not conform. Let's look at what he said. Do not conform to the pattern. So the world has a pattern. It has a system. It has a trend. You know the trend? Somebody will, will you know, like me now, I'll be putting on trousers that is torn. That is the trend. Is that not correct? And somebody will be wearing it torn trousers. Is that not correct? I'm asking you now. Is that not correct? Torn. The trousers is torn. And, the, and you see wearing boxer. You know what they call boxer? Uh, then the boxer, then you start seeing the boxer, the pan. Then you see walking like this. You know, that is the trend. <laughs> that, that, is the trend. That, that is the pattern. The, 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 that is the pattern, the trend. Look at The like Bible said, do not conform to the pattern of this world. But be what? Transformed by the renewal of your mind. Then you will be able to test and approve what God's will is. It's good, pleasing, and uh, perfect will. Number three. Okay, finish. Uh -huh. For by the grace of God, I say to every one of you, do not think of yourself more highly than you ought, but rather think of yourself with sober judgment, in accordance with the faith God has distributed to each of you. My brother, without fire, no sacrifice. Please, let's go back to that scripture again, Romans 12. Without fire, no sacrifice. He said, therefore, I urge you, brothers and sisters, in view of God's blessing, to offer your body. So your body is a sacrifice. Your body is a living sacrifice. Your body is what? That is my brother. That is my brother. That is my brother. So now the question is, what is your sacrifice? Your mindset. Your mindset. Your, your reasonable faculty, your mindset is your sacrifice. Your mindset. What is inside your mindset? Your mindset. Whatever you are saying, I am a sacrifice. I am a sacrifice. That is it, my brother. We are sacrifice. We are sacrificed. We are sacrificed. You know, conformed. Conformed and transformed. What is transformation? It means metamorphosis. In biology, if you are science student, you know what I mean. You know, we are being metamorphosed. So it's about your choices. It's about your yes or no. You cannot be saying yes all the time. There must be no. There must be what? No. There must be no. There must be no. That is you are changing. You are, you, you are metamorphosis. Number one is conform, transform, metamorphosis. Once you are conformed, you are transformed, you are metamorphosis. That means you have to change. You have to change. And when you, once you change, you have a choice to make now. Amen. Is it that yes or no? Oh, I don't like it. No. Okay, yes. No. Yet you cannot be saying yes all the time. That means you are compromising. Because it's giving you something, but you take it. You see, God will send help us differently. Amen? Amen. 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 My sister's in Christ. My sister's in Christ. My sister in Christ. It's about your choice. It's about, it's about, it's about, I can do this and I can, I, I can do this and I cannot do that. I'll tell you. It's about the friend you say yes to. It's about no to this friend and yes to this friend. So it's time to select your friend as you're about to enter to your friend. Select your friend. Yes. That's right. Tell them today, you know what? This thing you are doing, oh God, I don't like it though. Mm -hmm. I'll just metamorphose. Hey! <laughs> hey! 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 I'll just metamorphose. Before I was conformed. Now yes. I'm transformed. Don't call transformed. Now I am not metamorphose. Mm. Don't never say I am metamorphose. I am metamorphose. <laughs> <laughs> that is it. So you really want to pick your friend, not your friend speaking you. Not your friends picking you. You are the one picking them now. Picking them now. Because you are now conformed, transformed, and metamorphosed. So, my brother, my sisters, is look, once you are, uh, once you are metamorphosed, you can tell your friends yes or no. It's about no to this friend and yes to this friend. It's about your reasonable service. Because you're no more conformed, 
they transform in metamorphosis. Anybody, somebody? Yeah. Anybody, somebody? Yeah. Now let's go to Psalm 23. Now the perfect will of God is this one. The Lord is our what? So what the Lord is leading you? Look, the Lord is our shepherd means the divine direction. So divine direction, when God leads you, you know that the grass is there. There's a food here. So he's the one leading you. You're not the one leading me. You're not the one leading God. He's the one leading you. He knows where the grass is. He knows where the food is. Is that not correct? That's why I said, the Lord is my shepherd. I lack nothing. Anytime you lack something, it means that God is not there. You send yourself there. When God told me to come to Korea, I heard him audibly. Come to Korea. I heard him audibly. Audibly. I heard him audibly. When he told me go, to go back to Nigeria for the church planting, I heard him audibly. That's right. He said, go back and go and plant the church. Amen. Go back. God knows I never ask you for any, any money. Not from the church. God knows. I never ask you, say, bring money, today we are going to do next. Did, no, no, no. I'm telling my mother. Somebody just came back. Somebody, she just came back. After going for something important, yeah. she just came back and said, Pastor, I told you from the airport that when I call, I will what? I will do something for the church building in Nigeria. I said, what is it? I said, you just came up with, you know. My wife went there, um, she gave my wife something. Wow. When we came back home, what happened? A million. A million! Oh, for the project there. Mm, yeah. So when God sent you, no, no. I'm telling you, my brother, mm. one million, you just came back. Because everything about God has consumed her. Yeah. I never ask you, say, let's Let's all donate for the church. Have I asked you? No. I have never asked you. I have never asked you. The God is using different people because He told me the Lord is my shepherd. Once our Lord is shepherd to lead you, He will lead you where the grass is. He will lead you where the food is. Just allow Him to lead you. And leading you is a divine direction, divine direction, divine guidance. You will not lack anything when he leads you. When he leads you. When he leads you. When he leads you. Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. And ask God to lead you as we're about to enter 2023. Don't lead God. Allow him to lead you. He know where the food is. He know where the business is. He know where the food is. He know where the grass is. He knew it now. I'm telling my brothers and my sisters. But if you go where he, he, he didn't send you, you are just on your own. Yeah. Oh, you are on your own. You will lack. <laughs> you will, oh, my brother, my sisters. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. So, fire baptism comes with the Holy Ghost baptism. In this level, you don't lead yourself again. But God leads you. How? By living a life of sacrifice, a life of devotion. Then by having the word of God, the Holy Ghost baptism and fire baptism makes us to live a holy life. My brother, my sisters, let's open to one scriptures again. Now, this is Jeremiah. Don't forget Jeremiah who spoke before. Remember, talk about Jeremiah, right? Jeremiah, something happened to him. Look at what happened to him. Look at what happened to Jeremiah. Jeremiah, when we read Jeremiah, that we're about to ask, look at what he said. He said, but if I say, I will not mention his word and speak anymore in his name. What happened? He said his word is in my heart like what? In fire. A fire shot up in my bones. I am weary of holding it. Indeed, I cannot. There are two signs. Sometimes men of God they are depressed. Jeremiah is not depressed now. He said, I will never make mention of your name again. No way. Because of the people. I will not mention. But when you remember the fire in his bones. There are times I cannot drive from soul to answer. You think it's easy for six years driving? No accident? Hey. My you mom. think it's easy? Every Sunday I'm here. There was a time we were doing all night. Every last Friday I'll be here. Question number I'll be here. It's the fire. Yeah. That doesn't sound weak to drive. I need a driver to help me drive too. 
Then when fire touches my bones, I will, I will take the steering. I said, Holy Spirit. I said, Holy Spirit, start driving. I'll tell you. So, Jeremiah was depressed. He said, I will never make mention of your name anymore. I will never, Lord. No, no. Because of the people. I can't mention. So you lied to me, God. You lied to me. You lied to me. You said I should be healthy. You said, you, you, you told me to go out. <laughs> then I look at what is going on now. Then look at, he said, his word is in my heart. There's something about the heart. The Bible says in Psalm 66, verse 18, he said, if I regard iniquity in my heart, what I want? So your heart is more precious than gold. That is real destruction of life. That's where everything, your heart, your heart, your heart, your heart, your heart. So my heart, like a fire. If not, is that like a fire? You never had to describe it again. He said, a fire shot up in my you know what you know what you got boss? Boss in my weakness. My God. In my tiredness. In my depression. You know, when he hooks him, I'm going to stand up. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Is it it driving on the way from so six years? Mm. I'm telling you. So I want to fire it up as we're about to enter 2023. To have the fire. Fire. That which you need will come to you. Amen. Don't pursue it. Don't see me to pursue you. If you pursue you, we pursue you. If you pursue you, we be pursue you. You now you are after you are pursuing it. You are pursuing it, but it's not coming. Mm-hmm. Even if it come, check out you discover nothing. You start, yeah, you start wondering. I have been walking like an elephant. Is that correct? Yeah. So it's better to walk like an ant. And eat like what? And without my sisters. Now, let's see. The last scripture today. The last scripture, right? This is the last scripture. Amen? Amen. We thank the Lord. Amen? Amen. I want you to raise up your hands, please. And stand up as you pray. Raise up your hands. Say, as I raise up my hands. As I raise up my hands. I surrender all to you. I surrender surrender all to to you. Let fire. Let Let fire. fire. Born, Born in me. In me. Every spirit of barrenness. Every, every spirit of barrenness. Every addiction. Every addiction. Will be born by fire. Will be born by fire. Let that demon of addiction. Let that demon of addiction. Catch fire now. 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 Every witchcraft that was done. Against me, against me. Catch fire. Catch fire. Every witchcraft, Every witchcraft that, was that was done against me, against me. in my village, in my father's house, in my mother's house, in my inner house, catch fire, 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 every demon of stagnation, catch fire, catch fire, catch fire, catch fire, catch fire. Now we're going to pray more. Say with me. Mm. Powers of my father's house. Powers of my father's house. Attacking my star. Attacking my destiny. Attacking my calling. Attacking my business. Attacking my business. Attacking my finances. Attacking my finances. Wherever you are. Wherever you are. Catch fire. 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 Today. I receive fresh fire. Now. Now. Now, say I receive, say I receive, say I receive, say I receive, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh fire, fresh power, fresh fire, fresh anointing, fall upon me, now, 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 in the name of Jesus Christ, now put your hands to the heavens. Put it to the heavens. You know, we have three heavens, don't forget. Yes. We have three heavens. We have the first one, which you can We have the second one, we have the third one. I'm telling you. So put your hand to the heavens. We are praying right now. So, powers. Powers. Challenging God in my life. Challenging God in my life. Powers. 
powers. Challenging God in my calling. Challenging God in my calling. Powers. powers. Challenging God in my career. In my career. In my business. In my marriage. In my children. In my children. Anywhere you are, you are a liar. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Catch fire. Powers. Of my father's house, of my mother's house, of my in laws house, challenging God in my life, in my marriage, in my career, in my business, in my ministry, in my calling. Catch fire. Say you are a liar. Catch fire. Go on, I'm making the pressure. Any power can you go? I'm telling you, go ahead and pray for you.
Yes. I when I go out, I, I am blessed. When I call in, when the blessing of supernatural overflow rest upon me. Rest upon me. Rest upon me. Your business, my business, my, business, my, business, my career, my, career my, studies, my studies, my ministry, my ministry, my ministry, my ministry. we need it increase. <laughs> Overflow. No matter the economy, I will enjoy supernatural overflow. So the days of my life shall be long, shall be fruitful because of God's mercy, because of God's goodness. So the goodness and the mercy of God will preserve me and my asshole from all diseases, from all sorrows in the name of Jesus. God's goodness, God's mercy, we we erase every mistake, every setback in the name of Jesus Christ. So it's from today until the end of December, I will enjoy resounding victories, resounding victories, resounding victories in the name of Jesus Christ. Everywhere I go, it will be testimonies of God. God is following me. The goodness and mercy of God will answer for me. Will answer for me in times of need. In times of need. The goodness and the mercy of God will take me to, to height of glory. Beyond my expectation. Nothing will take me away from the presence of God and the fellowship of the saints. Every step I take this morning shall be ordered, shall be marked with the goodness and the mercy of God. My path, my path, my path, my path, my path, my path, my path is evil and shall free and shall free and shall free any man, any woman that wish me to die, they will die in my death, 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 anywhere they gather against me, speaking. Of me, oh no, blind them, 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 In my life, in my system, in my lungs, in my liver, in my kidney, on my bones, on my eyes, on my ears, on my head, by fire. Come on, you. Come on. 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 Of my grave, of, my of depression, you are not welcome. Yeah, you are a stranger. Yeah, stranger. I command you, I command you. Out. 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 In the name of Jesus, yeah, yeah, yeah. any authority, yeah, yeah. I push you back to the center. I will complete my days, my assignment, my purpose in this earth. I will not die by accident. I will not die by the devil. I will not die by witches. I will not die by wizards. In the name of Jesus, I declare from today, I am a fire. Fire in my bones. Fire in my lungs. Fire in my kidney. Fire on my eyes. Fire on my Oh, 
Thank you, Father. Go ahead and thank God. Just go ahead and thank God. Just go ahead and thank God. 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 As we begin to give our offering. Go ahead and thank God. Go ahead and thank God. 